Hello and welcome to myminimaths.co.uk video tutorial. And today we're going to be subtracting or taking away a two digit number from a two digit number and a three digit number from another three digit number. And first of all, we're on to question one, which is 68, take away or subtract 37. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to write out our numbers in the tens and the units, and we're going to subtract the 37. So let's have a little look. We've got our units first. So we're going to take eight units, so like eight apples, and so we're going to take away seven apples to leave us with one apple remaining left over and then we're going to look at the tens column where we have six tens that's 60 take away the three tens which is 30 to leave us with three tens left over for a final answer of 31 and another way to show this would be to show the the 60 as six tens We've got the eight ones and we're going to subtract the three tens for the 30 and the seven ones or units depending on which one you call them so let's have a look at those units again I'm going to take my eight units here and I am going to subtract seven of them. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that leaves us with a single one here. And then I'm going to take my, my six tens here. And I'm going to take away my three tens from here. So if I take my six tens, take away three of them, there's one, there's two, and there's three, and that leaves us with the three tens for the same answer of 31. And next we're on to question two, which is 85. Take away 14. So again, we can write out our numbers in our tens. So there's my 85, and I'm going to subtract the 10 for the 14, and then the four units. So let's have a look at these. Let's start off with our blue units. So I have five apples, take away four apples, that leaves me with one apple and onto the tens column I have 80 or eight tens 80 apples take away a single ten so that's ten apples that leaves me with seven tens for 70 for a final answer of 71 and again we can look at breaking down the different tens and units so if I have my 80 Five. Here's my five, one, two, three, four, five units or five ones. And the tens, the eight tens, so one ten, two tens, three tens, four tens, five, six, seven, eight tens, so ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty. And what we can do is we can remove these we're taking away 14 so first of all we're going to take away four units so that's one two three four and then we're going to take away the uh, the 110 for the 14 and that leaves us with seven tens and we've got the single unit for a final answer of 71 and next we're on to question three 
and this time we're going to use the hundreds column as well. So we have 435 and we're going to subtract 225. So again, if we start with our columns, we have 435 and we're going to subtract the 225. So let's have a look at our units to begin with. We've got our five units, take away five units, which leaves us with zero, nothing, uh, no units or ones left over. Then we're going to look at our tens. So we have three tens, 30, take away two tens, 20 for a single 10. And finally, in our hundreds column, we have four hundreds, take away 200s to leave us with 200 for a final answer of 210. And again, we can look at these as individual place values, the different parts, the hundreds, the tens, and the units. So first of all, we have 400. So we have 100, another 100, a third 100, and now we have four 100s. We have 30 which is a 10, a 10, and a 10. And finally, we have five ones or five units. One, two, three, four, five. And what we need to do is we need to take away 225. So if we take away the units to begin with, so we need to take away five. So there's one, two, three, four, five. And then we need to take away the 20. So that's two tens. There's one, two. And then finally, we need to take away the two hundreds or two of the hundreds, wrong color. There's 100 and 200. And all together, it leaves us with 200. 10 and nothing so it gives us a final answer of 210 and finally on to question 4 which is 836 and we're going to subtract 235 so first of all the first number is 800 and 36 and we're going to subtract 235 so again units first or we start from this side units first so we're going to have six units or six ones take away five units or ones leaving us with a single one then in the tens, three tens take away three tens, leaving us with nothing, zero. And then finally the hundreds column, where we're going to subtract eight hundreds, take away two hundreds to leave six hundreds for a final answer of 601. And again, we can break these numbers down into 800. So that's 100, 200, sorry, 300 and 400, 500, 600, 700, and finally 800, and a 30, which is a 10, 10, and a 10, three tens for 30, and then finally, we have six ones or six units, one, two, three, four, five, six, and we're going to subtract the 235. So first of all, we'll start with the units. We're going to take away five of the units away from the six. We've got six to start with. We're going to remove two, three, four, five. 
that leaves us with the one unit then and to start with 30 and take away 30 so that's three tens there's one ten two tens three tens so that leaves us with nothing zero and finally onto the hundreds column where we started off with eight hundreds and we're going to subtract just two of them for the 200 so there's 100 removed taken away and another 100 taken away leaving us with with the six hundreds left over for a final answer of 601 thank you very much for watching today and i look forward to speaking to you again soon take care